and welcome to my kitchen, I'm Julia. So on this episode I'm going to show you how to make one of my favorite snacks and that is some chili cheese bites. You might also know them as chili cheese tops. So let's get started. So what I'm going to use for my chili cheese bites is some breadcrumbs, some lightly whisked egg, some jalapenos and I have just used some pickled ones, you can also use fresh and you just add in the amount that you like. If you want them really, really spicy just add in a lot more. I'm also going to use some salt and I'm using some cheddar cheese. I've already cut it into some smaller pieces. And then I'm also going to use some flour and some oil for frying. And first step is to melt down my cheddar cheese. And I'm just going to pour it into my bowl here. Whoops. To have it all in there. And what I'm going to do is to take my bowl here and just make a pot ready over here at my stove with some boiling water and just place the, this bowl on top here and just stir it until my cheese is nice and melted and when my cheese is melted I'm going to pour in my jalapenos, stir it around and just place in the fridge for about 10 minutes just until it is slightly cool. So while my cheese is smelting over at my stove, I'm just going to prepare my breadcrumbs and what I'm going to do now is just to add some salt to it. Like that. And just give it a good stir. And when my cheese is smelted and my jalapenos are added in and when it is all done cooling in the fridge for a maximum of 10 minutes, I'm going to take it out and form it into some smaller bowls. And when that is done, I'm going to roll them in the flour, then into the eggs, and then into the breadcrumbs. And I like to double coat mine just to make sure that the cheese won't run out. So I'm going to place them back into the eggs and then into the breadcrumbs again. And when they have all been rolled into the breadcrumbs, I'm going to turn on for my fryer at 180 degrees C. I'm just going to fry them in there for about a minute or so and then they are ready to be saved. I hope you enjoyed my recipe for my chili cheese bites and if you want to give these a go just go down in my description and you can find all the ingredients down there. It is so so good and such an easy snack. It is not healthy at all but sometimes you just need something very delicious and very very cheesy so you have to give these a go. 
And don't forget to subscribe to my channel here. And I hope to see you all again tomorrow. Bye.